Hey guys, Steve at Sterling Tackle, back with more trolling tips. So right now we're gonna take a look at a nine rod spread with outriggers. And again, this is just for small boats. So center consoles and express boats, but uh, we'll take a look at both of them here. So first we're just gonna run through the spread as to about where things may be located. And then more importantly though, we're gonna look at where to put the rods themselves, what rod holders, how do you get this many lines coming off of a small boat like this? So let's take a look at it. Uh, first, um, you know, you, you're gonna put out your, probably your wide trackers on your widest lines there, and then probably your deep uh, line, your way, way back. And if you trace these forward, you'll see, this is the important part, you'll see where they go. And this is because we're trying to keep these separate, okay? Um, so they would go to some more forward rod holders. If you do have a center console, definitely use your bow rod holders for your widest trackers, okay? That is gonna be a big help to you. All right, now this is where it starts getting crowded. You need to use um, what we call the high positions, the rocket launchers overhead, the shotgun um, uh, rod holders. And if you have any apparatus, you'll see it on, an, on another diagram I show here, you, you need to learn to how to use those because in this case, like look really closely here, we actually have the tips of the outriggers are getting pulled from a raised rod holder. See it right here? And then there it goes out to the tips and there's your singles, you know, in the spread back here. Um, that you need to try to work out. And the reason for that is that high rod holder, let's go to another drawing. You can see th these are the ones that would be going to your outriggers. Those lines need to go above everything. So even when they disengage and snap back and get a bite, that they are clear and they're not trying to take out something else with them. So uh, just remember that. Now, I love all of these top rod holders here. I love these ascending rod holders. As you try to lay out your spread, your boat will not be exactly like this boat. You need to figure these things out on your boat. These are just general principles so you can get started with this. Okay, and then look here. Here's something to consider. Um, look at these two rods. You can see using a gunnel rod there and then also one raised up on the ascending uh, rod holders. You can see the gap that that puts in there. That gap is gonna be critical to keep lines apart, okay, as they go back. Because if you're on a turn or something, they need to cross over each other, they can. Um, so be aware and try to use that principle there as, as well. And that's it. So again, this is just basic and you're just trying to work things out on your boat. So when you're trolling, if you see something happening, they're going, well, that's not right. Then look and see where you can move those rods to, to make that spread work. Cause nine rods is a decent number coming off of that little boat right there. Thank you. Have a great day.